And there's a film in 25 minutes here on two, but in great contrast. It's part three of the Russians' own Academy Award-winning film of Tolstoy's War and Peace, and that's at 4.45. After Brian Kant and company, play away. ladles and jelly spoons. Now, this after morning, I want to show you something which has never been seen by nobody in the whole world before. And then I will make it disappear so that nobody in the whole world can ever see it again. Thank you so much, the drum roll. Now. There! Oh! I dropped it on the floor. There! You see? Nobody in the whole world has ever seen that before. <laughs> now, to keep my promise, I make it disappear so no one in the world ever sees it again. <laughs> what a nutty way to start the show. <laughs> Give me a P! Hey! P! P! Hey! Give me an L! 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 Give me an A! A! L! A! Give me a Y! Why? Why? Give me an A. 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 W. W. A. A. Why? Why? Ow! <laughs> what? They're eating sweeties again, Gettle? Sir, I ate. Six lollipops yesterday. Oh, tut, 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 tut. Don't you know you should say eight? Well, maybe it was eight I ate. Oh, listen, I have a question for you. If I had six toffee apples in this hand and ten toffee apples in this hand, what would I have? Big hands, sir. Big hands? Not very big. Yeah, my friend lives on Mars. She doesn't. She does. She eats about 20 a day. <coughs> my mum said I should share all my toffees with you. Here you are. What's this? All the toffee wrappers. Whoa! Hey, Walter. Oh, oh, another girl eating sweeties. Don't you realise that eating sweeties can make you very fat? Sir, I know somewhere where there's no fat people. Where's that? Finland. <laughs> Been here long. My teacher said not to put beans in my ears. Beans in my ears. Beans in my ears. My teacher said not to put beans in my ears, beans in my ears. Now why would we want to put beans in our ears? Beans in our ears, beans in our ears. Now why would we want to put beans in our ears? Beans in our ears. Well, you can't hear your teacher with beans in your ears. Forward, march, halt, left turn, forward, march, halt, 
Right turn. Sit. Sit at ease. Sit easy. Oh. <laughs> Morning. Oh, oh bloody. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. Now, what can I do for you? Oh, well, I'd like my big black bearskin barber indeed. Oh, you like your big black bearskin barbering? Yes. And how would you like it barbering? Uh, bouffant, bubble cut, bald? Uh, bobbed, I think. Bobbed, yes. good. Uh, before you uh, butcher my big black bearskin, you're quite sure you are a bona fide big black bearskin barber. Oh, I'm the best big black bearskin barber in Britain. Really? Well, that baffles me because basically I've never heard of a big black bearskin barber before. Uh, well, that's because <laughs> you've never brought your big black bearskin to a big black bearskin barber before. Oh, uh, well, you see, the brigadier said that my yeah. big black bearskin was becoming too bushy. Oh, Brigadier Belvedere. Yes. Bossy boots. Yes. Brownie said, yeah. your big black bearskin's becoming too pushy. Take it away to a big black bearskin barber and have it bobbed. Well, best not to be bothered, Brown, because by the time I've been busy, you'll have the best big black bearskin in the brigade. Oh. <laughs> have, you, uh, have you been a bearskin barber, big black bearskin barber, very long? Oh, yeah. yes, yes. I've been a big black bearskin barber since I was a broth of a boy in Bodmin. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I was a brilliant boy, big black bearskin barber. I won badges for being the best big black bearskin barber in Britain. <laughs> yes, yes. And now, of course, I have my own big black bearskin barber business. And uh, is it a busy big black bearskin barber business? <laughs> busy? Boy, oh boy, business is booming. Oh, yeah. So busy, so busy is the big black bearskin barber business. <laughs> that I... Yes. I am building... A bigger branch of my big black bearskin barber business. <laughs> my brother Boris. Oh, I see, yes. <laughs> You're building a bigger branch of the big black bearskin barber business for your brother Boris. But I'm passively British. Ah. <laughs> yes. Yes. Now, I'll just brush your big black bearskin with my brown bristled big black bearskin barber brush. Yes. <laughs> now, right. Have a butcher's. Oh, yes, yes, beautiful. Beautiful. It's the best big black basket in the brigade. Bound to be. Well, bye-bye, Barber. Bye-bye, Brown. Take your lift, right, lift, right, lift, right, lift, right, lift. Right, nice right. bloke. Stay! Sit! Shh! Mm. Do you shear shaggy sheepdogs? <laughs> shear shaggy sheepdogs? I'm the sharpest shaggy sheepdog shearer in Sheen. Smashing. She's so shy, she's shivering and shaking. So be sure not to show her the shears. Show her the shears? <laughs> Shame. <laughs> Talking of ants. Do you know out west we got ants as big as scorpions? Why, well, I seen one of them little critters carrying a stick on his back, big as a cigar. Now I even hear tell that they can eat their way through a whole field of sugar cane less than half a day. And ma'am, them's ants. <laughs> you should see the ants out in the east. Out there, I've seen an ant turn on a man, toss him high up in the air, and then trample on him with one foot. Well, what kind of ant was that? An elephant. <laughs> Here's an ant! Here's an ant! What kind of ant? B five four gum! Giant! Yeah, giant. <laughs> Fake ant. <laughs> Who are you? Brian K ant. Oh. <laughs> what one? What's this? Yes. Well, nearly under and Brian, put them away. Oh, sorry, I Come know. on. <laughs> here's an ant. Here's an ant. What kind of ant? What kind of ant? Elegant! Elegant! Head and jump! Head right, jump! Forward, march! Lift right, lift right, lift right, lift right, lift right, lift right, right, halt! Who's that? Sergeant! I've got another ant! Oh, yeah, okay. Uh -huh.
Descant. Oh. Here's an ant, here's another ant. Yes, I know. Everyone, welcome aboard the Ark. Terrible weather, innit? My name, my name's Mr. Noah. Now, has anyone here seen my wife, Mrs. Ooh. Noah? Anyone see? There she is there, hello. This is my wife. Perhaps you already know her. Noah. <laughs> I've been looking for you all over the yard. Have you, my yes. dear? Now, you better put this on. Oh, yes. Oh, you won't feel the benefit That's a good idea. Yes. Lovely. That'll that keep the rain off nice. Chest. That's just dandy. Oh. There we are. Right. Now, I'll tell you what I think we ought to do first. Yes. is to check all the animals, Put make sure they're here, and make sure they're in you twos. Right, do you know, my dear, right. Right, do you know this morning, I actually saw three toucans trying to sneak aboard. Oh. And do you know what I said to them? I said, no, 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 only two can go. Oh, <laughs> right, right, my dear. Now, we better get on with it before yes. the storm starts. Right, we better add. Now, yes. then, uh, two lions. Um, yes. Yes, and uh, uh, two parrots. Oh, yes, the parrots are here. Oh, yes, right. And two elephants. Can't see the elephant. Oh, they better hurry up, they'll miss the bowl. Oh, they're probably still back in their trunks. Oh! <laughs> I said to them, be just like the grizzlies, bring the bare essentials. Bring the bare essentials. <laughs> now then, two leopards. Two leopards? Two leopards. Yes. Yes, I thought I spotted them earlier. And uh, two uh, two camels. Ah, uh, yes. Yes, with, uh, with two umps. Oh, right. There we are, my dear. Oh. With two... Lumps. Oh, I'm very nice. A cup of tea. Do you know what I fancy right now? He's a piece of toast. Oh, that's easy done. Is that? Yes. Excuse me. What on earth are you doing, my dear? I'm just popping a couple of pieces of bread under the gorilla. Oh, I see. <laughs> <laughs> well, now, what else have we got? Two maggots. Anyone oh, seen two maggots two crawling maggots? about? Are they crawling up your chosen oh, leg? Oh, here they, they are, my dear. Oh, you found them. Yeah. What on earth are they doing in there? They said you told them to come in a pair. Oh, so I did. Oh, here, it's starting to rain cats and dogs, my dear. That explains why I stepped on a poodle. Oh, I think that's the flood starting. We'd better man action station. Right. right, ready to go, everyone. Here we are. We're off now. Right, take the help. Cast the drift. Ooh. Oh, what a storm it was. The rain flashed, the lightning flashed for 40 days and 40 nights. There was, there was sheet lightning, there was pillowcase lightning, there was fork lightning, there was spoon lightning. And at times, the waters got so dark, we had to turn on the floodlights. And then suddenly, one day, it all stopped. It all oh. stopped. And I sent forth a dove. And it came back with this in its mouth. Naturally, we pulled it. Oh. Come on then, my dear. Oh! What's this? Oh. oh! Look! The water's receding! <laughs> Quick! Open all the doors and tell all the animals to go forth and multiply! Go forth and multiply! Oh. First, uh, first the giraffes and yes. then the apples. Right, and the monkeys yeah. next? Well, they won't go, my dear. Well, why not? Because if they go now, they'll be third and you told them to go forth. Oh, I see. Well, tell the snakes to go next then. Well, they won't go either. What's the matter with them? You wanted them to go and multiply, and they can't. Why? They're adders. Oh. In that case, we'd better tell the gnus to go next oh, day, right. haven't we? Gnus? 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 Oh, Noah. What's wrong? I think we've left the gnus behind. Oh, dear. Well, that's it. That's what? That is the end of the gnus. Oh. <laughs> and now for the weather forecast. <laughs> Good evening. It's raining. It's pouring. The old man is snoring. He went to bed and he bumped his head and he couldn't get up in the morning. When I lock up my flat, put on my Sunday hat, it always starts to rain. When I'm indoors, it's great. But when I reach the gate, it always starts to rain. So I sing, rain, rain, go away. Come again another day. But it's all in vain. No matter where I go, if it don't hail or snow, it always starts to rain. Oh, no, don't let the rain come down.
makes all things beautiful. The flowers and the grasses too. If the rain makes all things beautiful, then why don't it rain on you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, quelle horreur! Il pleut! The rain drops keep falling on my head. And just like the guy whose feet are too big for his bed, nothing seems to fit. Oh, the rain drops keep falling on my head. Thank you for the head. I'm talking to the sun And I told him I did not like the way He got things done Sleeping on the job Oh, raindrops keep falling on my head They keep falling No, don't go no. I'm roller skating on a rainbow I've told my heart that you're the one Get up in the morning. Here comes the sun. Here comes the sun. And I say, he's all right. Little darling, it's been a long, long, lonely winter. Little darling, it seems like years since he's been here. Underwater. How do you mean underwater? Every grade was below sea level. Oh. <laughs> well, he never was very briny, was he? No, he's just interested in that rock and soul music. Well, there's a place for everything. <laughs> yeah, well, I better get me skates on, Mrs. Lobster. Mrs. Lobster's feeling a bit pinched, and uh, I said I'd collect her two nippers from their school. <laughs> That'd be ebb and flow. Mm, yeah, I was coming and going those two. Well, I must paddle off myself. I can't wait to get home, put me tail up, and have a nice drink on the rocks. Oh. I'm so tired. Well, I could just curl up on the waterbed, throw a wet blanket over my face, and drop off. <laughs> Meet you tomorrow, then. Oh, yes, yeah, same tide, same place. <laughs> See you! <laughs> Oh, 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 oh,
Oh. I've moved house and I've never oh. finished up looking like that. You would if it was the lion house at the zoo. Oh. Oh. What did Tarzan say when he saw the elephants coming? I don't know. What did he say? Here come the elephants. <laughs> oh. Why is it always hot outside a busy barber's? I don't know. Why is it always hot outside a busy barber's? Because of the barbecue. Yeah, I'll jump over this. Right. See now, she's cue jumping. <laughs> Tell me, what is long, yellow, it's got 48 teeth and a lot of black hair? I don't know. What is long, yellow, got 48 teeth and a lot of black hair? My comb. <laughs> Max! Is this the barber's? Yes. Do you do haircuts? Yes. Do you do shaves? Yes. How much is a haircut? One pound. How much is a shave? 25p. Shave my head. <laughs> Can you give me the time, please? No. Yeah, here. It's an apple. Eat it and listen for the pips. Oh. <laughs> Heat has really got to me, Sergeant Major. I'm feeling so thirsty. If only we could get one of those coconuts from the top of the tree. I could have a nice, long, cool drink. I've got an idea, sir. Yes? Why don't we wait until it's dark? Yes. I'll shine my torch up at the top of the tree. Yes. You shin up the beam mm. and knock down a coconut. <laughs> Sun's really got to you, hasn't it, Sergeant Major? I'm no fool, you know. The sun hasn't affected me. I know you. <laughs> yes, you'll shine your torch up there and wait till I'm halfway up the beam and then you'll switch it off. <laughs> I'm going to spend all my pocket money on bird seed. Oh, what sort of bird you got? No, I haven't got a bird yet. I want the seed to grow one. What do you get if you cross a cocker spaniel with a rooster and a poodle? I don't know. What do you get? A cocker poodle do. <laughs> oh, Heather. Yeah. Oh, yes. at home. At home, I've got this little sheep and he's called Ink. Well, why do you call him Ink? Because he keeps running out of the pen. Hey, Brian, man, why did the ant dance on top of the jam jar? I don't know why did the ant dance on top of the jam jar. Because the lid said twist to open. Oh, play away. Really doesn't matter if it's raining or...